Good morning, everyone. It is 1 Samuel chapter 20. It talks about Jonathan and David's bond, their friendship to the end um, with the looming death of King Saul on David's back. And <clears throat> there's some interesting points in here and some underlying things that I, I like to um, pivot on, which when you read the Bible, you shouldn't just read it or listen to it as words of fact, but try to get the understanding, the symbolism, what's behind it, and why were these words chosen out of all words um, when describing a scenario or situation. So with the death looming over David, he turns to his friend Jonathan, like, hey, let's let's come up with a plan. Um, let's do this and let's do that. And we it will decide whether, so let me go talk to my dad. And if he says this way, then he's probably come after you and then I'll shoot this arrow and if this boy does this way then you know it's good or you know it's bad and this is how he should warn David this is not testing God but it's to know if God is with you and so it's it's different when you come into across God and you say God can you let me know if you're here for me and let this happen or let this happen because God always has a plan for you and it's amazing to see how God works. So read the chapter to say and see what